This is Steve Carrington, Palmer Mayor, taking you five days into the future for our April 11th, 2023 City Council meeting at 6 o'clock. Uh, there's a consent agenda has got an action memorandum, which is the appointment of Trish Simmons and Sarah Tudor to the Board of Economic Development and also reappointment of Janet Kincaid to that Board of, Econo Board of Economic Development. And then under communications and appearances, we've got a governor's carbon initiative, Tom Smolden from the Matsu office of the governor is gonna come and talk to us. We've got a couple proclamations, and then there's a Matsu planning organization for someone from the borough will be trying to enlighten us as to what that is and why we're doing it. Uh, well, we've also got reports, the city manager's report has a an information memorandum about the library expenditures so far and what's kind of happening with the library. And then I've got a mayor's report. Uh, one of the things I wanted to highlight, uh, well, we've got a, a, a resolution later in the meeting for um, supporting the idea of opening a social security office in the valley out in Matsu. I don't know if anyone's ever done that day trip that it takes to go into Social Security Office in Anchorage, and uh, it, it takes, uh, we're talking multiple hours to do things there. It would be really helpful to have a, a Social Security Office out in the Matsu. And we have a public hearing, um, which is, uh, it's an ordinance or a zoning change for uh, a property which I believe is the old profile is an excellent property out there next to the highway. It's currently zoned R4 and there's an application to change it to commercial limited. So that public hearing will be happening later on in the meeting on the April 11th. I um, also wanted to mention that uh, we've got our Soroma is our sister city in Hokkaido, Hokkaido Japan. And uh, we made contact with them, or they made contact with us back in 1977. I believe some ham radio operators were communicating back and forth. And in 1980, Soroma sent a delegation over to Palmer. And then that year, we signed a sister city charter with the city of Soroma. And uh, we've got some uh, students are, are traveling over there in the next month or two. And the city uh, typically will... Uh, cover uh, about a quarter, 25% or so of the cost of those travel costs. So um, that, that will be happening. And also in the packet, I put in a letter I received from the mayor of uh, Saroma and I, my response back where they were supposed to host uh, a get together. Every five years, the cities would have a get together either in Japan or in Alaska. And uh, it was supposed to happen in 2020 in Japan, and they were asking since they didn't get to do that because uh, we had a few difficulties with the uh, pandemic, etc. They wanted to host it there, and I said that would be that sounded great to me, and then we would be working with them to try to figure out our 45th anniversary in Saroma in 2025. That would be 45 years then. And, but just wanted to let the council and the public know that we're having that communication and kind of working towards that in the future. Uh, things coming up in the community, the April 28th, 29th is Who Let the Girls Out in Palmer. Uh, it's usually quite a big event in Palmer. Also, April 29th, 10.30 uh, a.m., there is Storytime and the Muskox Farm. I believe that's put on with the Friends of the Palmer Library. And then after that, uh, May 6th and 7th is the 2023 Great Alaska Aviation Gathering. It's at the State Fair in, in Palmer and the Palmer Municipal Airport. That'll be the first weekend in May. And then we've also got a city clerk's evaluation at the end of the meeting, which is with the um, executive session. Uh, we, the city council of Palmer has three employees that work directly for the council, and that's the city manager, the city clerk, and the city attorney. So we try to have uh, kind of an annual evaluation for each of those where we kind of go over what's been happening and how we want to see things go into the future. And that's usually uh, handled with uh, executive session. That's a, a normal use of that executive session for that. So this has been Steve Carrington, Palmer Mayor, taking you five days into the future for our April 11th, 2023 meeting.